Who are you? I don't know who are you. You police man. Huh? You who are you? Am I a what man? Yeah. You show me card, you know. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I am in Huddersfield today and I'm doing something a little bit different. Everyone knows how I like to do things a little bit different sometimes. So we've come to Black Cat at the firework uh, factory. So basically, there is a firework factory owned by Black Cat in Huddersfield. But they are leaving the town after a hundred years. I'm going to explain why. So residents of Huddersfield will no longer be hearing fireworks going off during the day after Black Cat Fireworks decides to find a new method to get rid of their old stock. The famous fireworks company will be moving from Huddersfield and so will set enough fireworks to dispose of them in a safe way. However, following the concerns of resi residents, the company will find a new way to do so. Now, according to the managing director, Austin Brown, this was the safest way to dispose of old stock. But after listening to the concerns of residents, they will no longer be setting off for fireworks. So, it's just, it's just through these gates off the main road. So what we're going to do guys is we're just going to have a walk up and uh, we're going to have a look at this place before they move out. We're going to get drawn up because they, they won't be here much longer apparently. Now there's all metals removed so there's some empty buildings here. Some empty houses, I don't know what they're about. I don't know if it's some some sort of business or offices. There's a lodge there with a big no smoking sign up door. Anyway, I'm, uh, I'm gonna get a bit closer and then I'll come back to you. Yeah, so. This place actually looks derelict already, to be honest with you. And there's, look at all these sparklers. There's loads of sparklers. Just lying about on the table in one of these old sheds. I, I wonder if this is where they set the fireworks off. Yeah. This might be... Might be a way to set them all off. I mean, nevertheless, guys, this is quite an interesting visit because it's uh, you know you don't see stuff like this every day. Yeah, these these huts of. Um, these garages have definitely been used for setting fireworks off. That building there looks absolutely empty as well. Strictly no parking, keep clear at all times. Wonder where this leads to. Just gonna take some pictures, guys. So I've just just clocked that sign above one of the garages. It says the uh, fire station. How strange. So yeah, this is it. It's 
quite big security office over there. Don't, don't know if anyone's in there, but we're not going over there. Uh, no cigarettes or matches beyond this point. So this is side at building. It looks as though it's uh, almost empty already. There didn't appear to be anybody here, so we're going to go up to the gates, see if anyone's in security office, and then get drawn out. Some security guard, this guy, he didn't even come out. All visitors and drivers must report to reception. All, comp all company vehicles must be checked out and in. Please press for assistance. Does that bell go to you or them? Does it go to them? Yeah. Does that bell go to them? Nobody there. Nobody? All off. Eh? All, all off now. The doors are open? Yeah, yeah. Oh, is it empty now? Yes. Has everybody moved? No, not moved. Just off, you know. Office time is off at 12 o'clock. All oh, right, because the site is closing down. Do you know when it's closing down? I don't know. I'm scared here. Yeah, do you mind if I go in and have a look round? No, no, not allowed. Not inside, just on the outside? No, no, I'm sorry. No? Yeah, you ring to company. Eh? That's it. You ring to company. Are you, are you, alright, uh, your security, yeah? Yeah, I'm security. <clears throat> no, but have you uh, got your SIA badge on you? Yes. G g where is it? Is it right? Why? Eh? Yeah, not allowed for you. It's an SIA badge inspection. Yeah, I have. D is it round your neck? Yeah. Can I see it? Why? I can't understand, you know. Oh, because you know your SIA licence? Yeah, I have his SIA licence. Yeah, but what I'm saying is it has to be visible to members of the public. Yes, it's the public, yeah. Yeah, I, I, it has I really, to be visible. Yeah. Section 9, yeah, it's the okay. Private Security Industry Act 2001. Yes, yes. Can I just have a is it just quick look? I don't know, who are you? Sorry? Who are you? Well, I could be somebody from SIA. You never know, do you? You SR? I don't know. You show me card. You never know. I'm just. I don't know. I'm here to do show an. Me card. I'm here to do an inspection. You show me card, you know. No argument, you know. Who's, who's I are you? arguing? Huh? I are arguing. Yes, I'm sorry. You're, yeah. you're, you're the person in in authority, so you need to show me your license. Yeah, I have a license. You well, know. just just show me that you're wearing who, it. Uh, who are you? I don't know who just, are you. Just show you're me, man. Huh? You who are you? Am I a what man? Yeah, you show me card, you know. I'm, I'm, I'm filming this, mate. Never mind. You need to show me it. Just sat in there eating his dinner, look. CCTV cameras up look. The whole site's covered, that's good. There's uh, quite a little custody office is that to be honest with you. Ooh, sorry about that, I'm zoomed in too much. Should we press this bell to see what happens? I only wanted to see his license. <sighs> Some security guard, eh? He didn't know who I was. Yet he uh, clearly watched me walking round. And just didn't come out and say, oh. Has he got a bed in there? I can't really see my camera. Is that a, a sofa? Oh, he's gone over there. Look, he's, he's gone out. He's run over there. What are you running away for? He's run away, look. He's put his shutter down. 
So this is a security guard officer who works for Shield Security. That, well, that's what it said on his coat. And uh, he refused to show me his license. It wasn't visible. He has now left his office and run inside and put the shutter down. And, uh, and that's security for you guys. That's a 10 bob a penny security what you get. Right, I'm going to get drawn up. I thought nobody were in. You move, soon as possible. If you don't move, I think you're in. Okay? Yeah, yeah, but you I'll said... I'll give you five minutes. I'll give you five minutes. All right. If you move, it's okay. Otherwise, I think... All right, you, all right. so okay. you're giving me an order to move Thank then. You. Right, can I see your SIA license? I told you, you move. Right, can I see your SIA license? I'll give you five minutes. Right, I'll give you five minutes, I and mean, if police come and you haven't got it on, my yeah, friend, yeah, you're going to get into trouble. Yeah, you do what you want. I thought you said no one were in office. Somebody is in there. Right, we're going up to uh, drone footage, guys.
this phone's ringing and he don't even know because he's run off there he is we're back on ground bike where guys it will not come out will it just gonna have hang about and see if old bill come because uh, we all know what Kirk Lee's police are like guys they're all corrupt rotten to the core can you ask your boss to come out I only want to ask her a couple of questions about the building. So there's, there's an empty building in there. And uh, this is literally next to the firework factory. So I'm imagine, I imagine it's something to do with or was something to do with that but it's kind of it's kind of what is it isn't it it's kind of turned into a little urbex as well windows open and uh oh don't tell me oh must have been sleeping up here Right guys, I'm going to wrap it up. Um, he has been on phone to the police. Uh, I've been still here for quite a while, but nobody's turned up. Surprise, surprise. The uh, the police get get paid for by the public, and then they don't show up to jobs. Well, by the taxpayers, anyway. Um, yeah, I'm going to make my way back to the car. We're going to have a wander around Goodersfield. See what kind of things we can see. Maybe at another, super, uh, maybe at another shopping centre. Who knows? Go check what the parking's like outside the police station. See if they're behaving themselves. But yeah, if I uh, if I get any interactions, guys, from, from here to going to my car, I'll come back to you. But if not, I'll love you and leave you all. And I'll see you in the next video.